I had to come home. Before I'm an artist, I'm a black girl from the north side of Tulsa, Oklahoma. Past 46th Street. I called my cousins, I'm like, yo, meet me at Tasty Freeze, we shoot the video. I, I, I didn't want any extra cast members. I wanted, I wanted the people I grew up with, my family, my nieces, my nephews. Real stories, stories that I know, stories that I've lived. There's this sweet simplicity to Tulsa, you know, a bit of nostalgia that I wanted to share. And when I think about what this song looks like visually, I just see my family. Um, I see my aunts, all my grandmother's sisters who live in one house, taking care of one another. I see their faces, their hands. Yeah, th this song is theirs. So, rightfully so, it had to be shot here. You know, every Sunday, uh, my family goes to my Aunt Kui's house, and my uncle's sitting in the garage, and my auntie's sitting on the porch, and sometimes they just look at each other and smile, and other times they laugh and talk. Uh, but... There's always this quiet hope that I feel like I get when I look at them. Like they are expecting something, always waiting, always hoping, believing, dreaming. And um, that's what something, something is. I wanted to embody this childlike faith that I get from them. There's really an art to making mundane moments feel really magical and Ray and Jess and Christian I feel like captured this video so beautifully in my family so perfectly it wasn't really staged it was just it felt organic I think that's what I love about Tulsa the most, though. It's, it's easy living. It's, it's simple. And the values that were instilled in us when we were younger were like, family is everything. It's funny when when, when I tell people I'm from Tulsa, they're like, is black people in Tulsa? And I'm like, yes. There's a gang of black people in Tulsa. What do you mean? Have you ever heard of Black Wall Street? Have you ever heard of Tulsa Massacre in 1921? Like, it's a gang of black, beautiful, strong people. I didn't really know what to expect, you know? I, I didn't really prep my family that much. I was just like, yo, we shooting the video, and the whole crew came in from LA, Yaz and PZ, Marcy, Nima, they all flew in from Cali. And uh, I think one of the best parts was just seeing all the people that I love and all the people who have helped to get me to this point, just connect. Um, it all it all felt, felt perfect, like. <laughs> So my first performance shot was actually shot in the house I grew up in. I had so many, I don't know, mixed feelings. For me, the performance is were very hard because uh, I can just be in my head too much, you know, overthinking everything and the guys and Jess. I mean, they just relaxed me and helped me lock in. <laughs> that was this moment that uh, the guys set up. That was me, my grandmother, my mom standing in front of the house. And it just felt so epic and timeless and uh, I felt so honored to be standing next to them. Like, I am their story, right? Their tangible story. And I felt proud, proud to be that. 
right here on this property uh, in 1921, white rioters destroyed a beacon of black prosperity and security and killed over 300 African Americans. And, you know, I never even heard about the burning of Black Wall Street when I was growing up. And so my job as an artist is to make sure the narrative is truthful and honest and the people here are honored. Everybody was so down to earth in making this video happen. Like, doing the most outlandish, random things, like me telling my daddy to grab his tractor and, you know, let us shoot him. And um, these are some of the moments that I feel like matter most to me, um, especially me watching him work. Um, and not just, you know, natural work, but more than more than anything internal work right the work of rebuilding the work of hope at this time he was dealing with cancer so the work of healing and keeping the family together um it was just beautiful <laughs> man there's a level of mastery that these guys operate in and they're super meticulous about every shot, like every frame, the angles. And um, that actually made me want to step my performance game up, um, just watching their commitment to the best. And that's what it's about. You know, it's about putting your art in the right hands. <laughs> I don't think I could have asked for a better first video shoot. I mean, everything was just, it was flawless. And uh, hopefully I made my mama proud. This song was for her. And uh, yeah, something, something. <laughs>